Did you know that we have 10 times more bacteria than human cells in our body? But don't worry, it's actually a good thing. Bacteria play an important role in maintaining good health and can be found everywhere. They are all around us in the environment and in our food, where they contribute to creating the taste and appearance that we like. The most common bacteria naturally present in food are lactic acid bacteria. You may already know that they are used to create such food as yogurt, cheese, salami and wine. This process is called fermentation. During this process, the good bacteria, also called food cultures, grow and multiply. For several thousand years, people all over the world have been more or less aware of fermentation because it is a good way to preserve food. But whereas in the old days, fermentation happened randomly and with little control, today, with our advancement of science, we can add the good bacteria as an ingredient in food production and ensure a reliable and consistent quality every time. However, bad microorganisms can spoil our food or make us sick. Some can even kill us. That's why it's important to protect our food against these bad microorganisms. A strict hygiene standard in food production facilities is a must, but it is not enough. That is why many food producers are adding chemicals to keep the bad guys at bay. Building on ancient traditions and relying on the newest scientific insights, we can use good bacteria to prevent and slow down the growth of bad bacteria, yeast and moulds in our food. We use our deep knowledge of natural bacteria and microbiology to identify and select the best of the good bacteria to do this job. We call it bioprotection. How does bioprotection work? As good and bad bacteria compete for the same nutrients naturally present in our food, the good bacteria can eat the food that bad bacteria live on, starving bad bacteria and wiping them out. Good and bad bacteria also compete for space, which means that good bacteria can outnumber and defeat bad bacteria. And like the coolest of troopers, good bacteria can attack bad microorganisms by producing natural organic compounds. Good bacteria can even signal in cell-to-cell -cell communication, affecting or preventing other species from spreading. So naturally occurring bacteria can be our friends and our nature's own way of keeping our food fresh and safe longer. In other words, good bacteria are nature's own way to keep it great. <laughs>